Hey guys, it's me. Gonna wait and see who comes in. If anybody wants to visit. So. Hey Lynn. Hey, when you get your package from me, let me know if you're missing an earring like this because I thought I put a pair of earrings in like this for you. And uh, let me know if you're missing a match because I think you were the last one that I'd done earrings. So, hey, Sophie. Hey, Jennifer. Hey, Perla. Anyway, uh, so this is one of my shirts that I got from Des and uh, it's color blocked. It's got white, white here and white, a white band. I really like it. It's real comfortable. So. Anyway, so I want to show y'all some things that I found today and um, uh, one thing I found yesterday. So, and then um, maybe if we have time, we'll go through these religious, um, this religious lot. Somebody asked me to, uh, to do a reveal on this lot, this religious lot that I had gotten from Dad. So, I have it sitting right there. So, so I want to show y'all these. I bought these yesterday, and uh, I think they're freaking cool, <laughs> and uh, they are awesome, and I'm going to use them for picture taking. I'm going to use them to drape jewelry across for pictures. So, anyway, hey, Rosalie, how are you? So, hey, Jude, how are you, hon? So, I think they're just neat. I'm going to... Uh, you know, I can drape them. The lady said that actually she used to have a bird that sat inside of them. She didn't know what happened to the bird. They're real dusty inside. I've I've cleaned them once, but I'm going to have to clean them again. So, anyway, so these are some things I found. I got both of these. She sold these to me for two for a quarter. Look, there are little blue frogs sitting on mushrooms. I think that's funny. I don't, uh, that's just, that just struck my sense of humor really funny. So, little blue frog mushrooms. Hey, Lucy, welcome. So, hey, Lori, welcome. Aren't they cool? The mu frogs on the mushrooms. So, anyway, Lori, did you get your invoice from me? Because I show, I, I sent it, but I don't know if you got it or not. And then, um, this butterfly and isn't he cool but he's missing the pin part and i'm pretty sure i can fix that so anyway so i will get it fixed and uh it'll probably go in the vanessa bag because i have a vanessa bag so today i bought oh, oh i was gonna say what's in there and then i remembered what was in there my mom uh Oh, there we go. Anyway, so I bought this little mesh bag. Uh, it is. It don't have anybody's name in it. It's not any brand name, but it's just so stinking cute. Isn't it cute? It's made in China. Okay. Thank you. So, and if you paid today, I might not have gotten notifications. So. Anyway, so anyhow, so I got that little mesh bag. Isn't it cute? So very, very cute. So let's get into the bags. So I bought three bags. I got this bag. It was two ninety nine. This one was four ninety nine. And this one was $4.99. Yeah. And then I bought three pieces separate. Now, everything, I had a 20% off coupon that I got off of everything. So, I got this. It was $1.99. Let me hold him up a little bit. This little owl, he was $1.99. He's got enamel inlay on him. Yeah, the little black mesh bag is cute, isn't it? So, that little owl is adorable. He's really cute. And then I got these two things. So, 
you're fine. Don't worry, you're fine. Then I got this little guy, and he is stamped Sterling. So, and we know who he's for, right? Him a turtle. Him is for me, and he was four ninety nine, and then thirty uh twenty percent off, which uh takes a dollar off. So, and then this guy, and he too was marked to nine two five. And he's stamped 925. I do not know if the chain is 925 or not. But she had 1999 on him. And uh, I said, oh, he's cute. But he's just a little bit too much for me. Anyway. And so she pulled him out and marked him down to 799. So then I had 20% off. And I got him too. And he's a little turtle. This is came from Savers. Savers. I went to town today, big town. So, Savers. So, so anyway, let's see. Oh, I am going to show y'all some things that I got from the Veterans Thrift Town before I start opening this jewelry. So, I got this little bag, little butterfly bag, and it's uh, like a brush denim. It was only $1.50. And it's cute. And then I got this. And I really think I'll put these on um, on uh, on eBay. So, uh, they're brand new. They're still sealed in the package. And it is a dollhouse furniture kit. And it's a four-piece kitchen set. And it's still in its package. So, I haven't done any research to see about how much it sells for. But uh, uh, it has all the instructions and diagrams and all that back there. So, anyway. If you have a uh, Value Village, Value Village and Savers is the same thing. So, and then I got this. And this is uh, an Eclip, which is an electronic shape cutting machine by Sizex. And uh, this is one of the cartridges, the design cartridge. And it's. Uh, kitchen it cuts out kitchen shapes and it you work it with your um with a size x electronic size x and thank you misha i got it in des's auction for a dollar fifty or something like that two dollars anyway but uh uh anyhow but uh I paid a dollar for this and uh, they sell for about $17, $18. So it's going on eBay. So let's open this $2.99 bag and we'll go from there and see what we end up with. And uh, I actually bought, so be careful because I, it has staples and I got into the staples last time. Uh, I bought this bag for one thing that I can see in it. It has a bunch of watches in it and y'all know I don't like watches. But it has a great big cuff bracelet. And I do like cuff bracelets. But it also has a whole bunch of these thingamabobs. And uh, y'all know I have some of those thingies. Oh, and these are vintage ones. These are uh, trifles and treasures. They look like a Kmart label. So let's see if I can get. Looky there. There's one. It has it on it. So, hey, Dawn, you are, it's okay, honey. I am not. I just was worried that because it was the first time that maybe I sent it to the wrong address. So, anyway, you are totally fine. So, oh, this even has the little clippy thing on it. So, there's the little clippy thing. I have some more of those little clippy things, too. But the twist the bead. So, all of these can be twist the beads. So, there's blue, pearly, blue, bright blue, lavender, red, green. So, all that. And a gold one. Oops. Hold on to you because you may have a match. So, those are all. And I'm going to see if I can fasten them all. Except for, of course, this red and brown one would want to separate. Here we go there. I'm going to fasten them all with the twister. 
So, hey, Greenberry, how are you? So, anyhow, there we go. Dawn's channel. There we go. So, the, the twist the bead. And I have several of those things, and I just un, unfastened it after I opened it. So, hey, Kimmy, how are you, honey? There. So, I'm going to twist those all together so they'll stay. I love twist the beads. I think they're cool. They, I mean, they make me think of when I was in high school. So, twist the beads were all the rage when I was in school. So, these are weird. Like, really weird. Look. Okay, y'all know I don't like ribbon and I don't like cord. That's just really weird. Thank goodness it was in a $2.99 bag or I would have been upset. Okay, somebody, this is a not this is a bag of stuff that she had not put on the floor. So she has it taped together to keep it from somebody had it taped together to keep it from tangling. It's that really thin stuff. And they look like hematite blocks. I don't know what they are. So who's going camping? Burr. Okay, this is this is why I bought it. Isn't that cool? Mm, let's open it up just a little bit so I can get it. There we go. There. That's cool. So, that's cool. Anyway, I won't wear it because it makes my arm poof out. It makes my arm look funny. So, I like that. That necklace belongs to Carmen Miranda. So, I like that. I mean, I know it's not silver or anything. It's highly magnetic, but I still like it. It don't have to be silver. Oh, look, pearly, little pearly earrings. These will go on the dollar auction. Guys, I am going, oh my gosh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight of them. So, next Thursday night, a week from tonight, not tonight, but a week from tonight, I will be having an auction over on the Glam Squad, and I will be auctioning off, I'm doing a dollar auction, all the, a dollar and two dollar auction. All the jewelry that I'll be auctioning will be a dollar or two dollars. And uh, anyway, and then the shipping will be actual shipping. But you're going to want to buy more than one piece, obviously. But everything I'm offering is, I'm, I'm, uh, I have way too much on my dollar boards in my booths. And I thought, you know what? Why not share it with my friends? So, because I, I put nice things on it. So, that's just kitty kid stuff. So, I will save it for my niece. And uh, um, my face just went flush. I just felt it flush all of a sudden. Oh, cute. A little Dreamweaver key ring. That'll go in the key ring pile. Because my mama collects key rings. So, I always keep key rings for her. So, anyway, you like those little pearl earrings? Aren't they cute? So, there's three pairs on them. So, they'll be a dollar for three pairs. Where else can you buy little three pairs of pearl earrings? So, they're pierced. They got the little backs on them. So, you know, what is that? Oh, that's a, it looks like a breast cancer awareness symbol. Anyhow, that's cool. Let me see if I can pull it towards y'all. There, there. Or it looks like an L or a target. So, anyway, just a little necklace. So, we have, uh, a Marvel Avengers watch. Probably be in the dollar watch. Probably be in the dollar auction. We have a Timex Indiglo watch. And this one here will uh, has a chrome timer. Timer set. This one will go to my husband because my husband's been wanting a watch. So, and he'll wear it for about a week or so and then uh, it'll be when did I say the dollar auction is going to be? 
a week from tonight, a week from tonight, and I'll it will be over on Facebook on the Glam Squad. It it'll be my night on the Glam Squad. So anyway, it'll be a week from tonight. So that's a Timex Indiglo watch. So this one here is. I don't know what that says. What does that say? It says juiced. It's a juiced watch. <laughs> That's cute. It may be in the wash watch auction too. Watch in the dollar auction too. Blah 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 blah. That one is an Omron. Omron. I know nothing about watches. So I'm trying to figure out how I can do it the best way. This is another Timex Expedition watch that I can do it the best way that everybody can get in on it because uh, here's a Spidey. Ooh, this one's cute. A little snowflake watch. Kimmy needs that. She's got snow. And look, Kimmy, another set of pearls. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, my wrist hurts now. Oh, somebody's puppy dog they made who lost an ear. But, mm, yeah, look here at this. Oh, he's just a, he's a little hummer there. Isn't he cute? Just a little hummingbird. Maybe he goes on this. There's nothing on it. Works for me. <gasps> he does. He'll go on there. Just like so. Cute, 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 cute. I foresee him coming on the dollar auction too. Yeah. Shrinky dinks. Shrinky dinks. Shrinky dinks. Shrinky dinks. I put stuff like this in a little baggie and like put it all at one price on the dollar auction. So, so. Oh, guys, I don't know if you guys know this or not, but I have merch now too. If you've not seen it, you need to go visit my, uh, um, my, the link to my merch stuff is in my uh, description. I have a t-shirt that I've designed and I also have um, some mugs, a mug and oh, several other things. So anyway, but I have a t-shirt that says I might be a Cindy Loves Jewelry Junkie. So anyway, that's cute. Those are little glass beads, a, a bracelet. That's real cute. And then there's a whole bunch of broken jump rings and stuff like that in here and i'll be keeping the jump rings because i'm always needing jump rings <gasps> vita are you watching vita vita it's a ladybug a little purple ladybug anyway and actually my t-shirts come in multiple colors they can come in a bunch of colors and they go all the way up to 5x so they are regular sizes and 5Xs all the way up. So that's all the junk in that one. Oh, except for I didn't show y'all this. This is a nice um, pendant. So, so. Yeah, my, the link to my merch is in the description box. So. Okay. Let's see. Do we want to open this one or this one? This one or that one? I think this one. So, and that had an unmatched earring in it. I need to make sure there's no more. Hey, Cherry Berry. How are you, hon? So, let's just see what's in this bag. And one of the things that I liked about these bags is they were not, they were not shelf pulls. I mean, some of them are, but some of them are not. And look at that, would you? It's broke. Gum it. Hate when I get broken things. You know what? That might be an easy fix. Oops. That might be something I can do, can work. I have a soldering gun. That might be something I can work on. 
with my soldering gun. So it, cause it's cheapy, cheapy. So, or I may save it and use these rhinestones and these, these teardrop shaped stones for something else. So, anywho, look, more little pearlies, more little pearlies. Oh, ain't he cute? He's a, he's a snowman. My kids, when they were little, they never said snowman. The, it was they were always snowmams, mams. They were always snowmams, and he's supposed to light up. Let's see. His little battery must be gone. Hey, Barbie. Anyway, yeah, he's a snowmam, so he's cute. Ooh, that's nice. Look at that chain, guys. Isn't that nice? Really heavy. What does it say? Oh, it don't say nothing. So, thought it was signed something. That's very nice. So, I loved the the video that you put up on Facebook of your little boy eating peanut butter and jelly, Kimmy. That was so sweet. Look at that. I don't know what it is, but it looks like it was made with shrinky dinks. It must have been a shrinky dink kind of week at the Savers because, and then there's that. And there's that. But a week from Thursday, a week from Thursday, you want to mark it and remember it. And I'll be putting up some, there's some more of those. I'll be putting up some reminders about this. Ooh, pretty, pretty, pretty. So these right here, these uh, bags that are $4.99, after the 20% discount, they end up costing $3.99. So for $4, oh my, I like that. Isn't that pretty? I may have to test drive this one for a while. Yeah, I may have to. So, we'll just keep it on. What does that say? It says St. Martin. No, St. Marin. Watch, says St. Marin. Two more pearlies. Pearly pearlies. He's a little turd. All little boys are turds. So... I loved my little boys. Okay. He says, is anybody else like me? I have to move my the hand so I can read and see what they say. <laughs> of course, it would help if I just would get out the O. Oh, he says carriage. So. Oh. I don't, uh, it is turtle day. Did you not see I had turtles while ago? I, uh, I had two, two star starling turtles earlier. Uh, little plastic pony beads. Those go in junk lots. I save a lot of this stuff like this. Uh, like Susan, she can cut pieces out of this and use it when it's long enough. So I save stuff like that for for people to buy in arts and crafty lots and stuff like that. These beads like this, they're just Mardi Gras, Dollar Tree beads. And, uh, yeah, I, I just stick them in. I just stick them in, in uh, craft lots. Maybe somebody can craft with them. I don't know. Uh, a little uh, wooden disc. Oh, my. Isn't that pretty? That's pretty. A little uh, leaf-shaped brooch. Oh, no. Max is sick. Poor Maxie. You're afraid of turtles? I love turtles. We've never had turtle as a pet. I have a, a hugely funny story about turtles. Uh, I had... Um, an older friend, she was about four years older than I was, and she had a little Dotson B, a uh, little Dotson truck, and we ran around in that truck. One day we crossed the little bridge down on the main drag through the little bitty town I grew up in, and uh, there was a huge turtle out in the road, and she stopped and snapped it up, snatched it up, and threw it in the back of her truck, and we drove to her house. Hey, Cece. And when we got to her house and went to get that turtle out, 
it turns out that turtle was a snapping turtle and he was mad because he didn't want to go for a ride and he was like and so her dad had to literally take a big heavy stick put it in the back of the truck and let that turtle snap onto it and then lift it out on the stick so and he gave us a good chewing but yeah that one is real pretty but it's lost and stretchy major loss and stretchy so so anyway where i live most of the turtles that you see in the road are not turtles they're actually terrapins and a terrapin is different than a turtle a terrapin has a big rounded shell big rounded shell and a, ter a turtle has a flatter shell and terrapins live on on uh they live on ground they don't live in the water like turtles do so anyway so that's cute blingy blingy here's another one of those ugliness it's pitiful uh there's some kind of a shell i don't know if they're true puka shells but they are some kind of a shell not sure oh i do know what that is it's a, a wine charm for you to put around a wine glass so anyway this one here does it say something it says believe and it is just little beads necklace so remember a week from today this one says studio it's a watch just in case you missed it uh, this one is merry christmas it's worth saying and that's really cool it's got the mother merry mother and the baby and that's really really a cool pen and it's a pen so I like that. And look, the little wooden beads with happy faces on them. Uh, more pins. Ooh, that's pretty. That's really, really, really pretty. It is not signed. Here we go. I know y'all want to know what I'm saying is pretty. So that's real pretty. It's a brooch. So, was originally four dollars. Very pretty. That's nice. Little beaded amber-colored beads. Uh, a little toe ring. Little beady one. And this one here is. Mark Thailand on that side and it looks like maybe sterling on this side so I don't think it's really sterling unless that's just tarnish on there actually that may just be tarnish because it's polishing out maybe sterling I mean, it's a little bitty ring so you got this little bitty ring here and then you got the little this is a toe ring it's split a week from today one dollars so cool barbie i paid yesterday as soon as you sent the invoice so uh, i gotta pay des here in a little bit those are really pretty beads they're glass or at least some of them are they feel but they're on a hemp like string and here's some more of those pearlies so in next week's auction that i mean in next week's sale i, I can't call it an auction because i'm not going to auction it off but we'll have items that will be one dollar and two dollars and uh and that's as high as it's going to go but there's going to be a lot of it and we're going to move really fast okay so some of it will be multiple so we'll offer i'll offer it and everybody that wants one can say just like all those pearl earrings you can say that you want one so everybody can get one for a dollar 
So they've got three pairs of earrings on them. They're cute for gifts. Anyway, so that's here's the last bag. We'll go through it right quick. Uh, we you've got one of these little cross bracelets that slides, bangles, and I do bangles like this. I usually put like three or four on a card and sell them for one dollar. <laughs> so there'll be lots and lots and lots and lots of stuff. Woo! Uh, purple and gold. Go cats! Go cats! Uh, <laughs> that's funny. I bought this in Fort Smith. And uh, it says Go Cats, which is Boonville Bear Cats, and then Boonville Bear Cat necklace. So I will save it and give it to some of my children's church kids. I will probably put it in the prize bucket for them to pick. Gorgeous beads, yucky ribbon. Beads will go in a crafty lot. So anyway, uh, this is a tassel that is attached to a key. Next Friday or so on Wednesday. So it has a little key. It has that. Anyway. We'll ring your bell, Kimmy. We'll ring your bell. So... Anyway, hey Peyton, how are you? So next Thursday night, I'm a building up the suspense. I'm having a dollar sale, a dollar and two dollar sale. Nothing will be higher than two dollars. Most of it's going to be dollar stuff. Well, isn't that interesting? What are they? Huh? Not sure what they are. are they. They have symbols and stuff on them. That one there looks like the Jolly Ranger. I don't know. Maybe it has something to do with one of those funny shows that I don't watch. What is that one? The one, Hunger Games. Oh, what does that say? Oh, it says 2015 Disney. Oh, it's a Disney bracelet. I don't know what it's from. Dollar, dollar, dollar bill. Yep. Hey, Gina. Anyway, okay, does anybody recognize this Disney? I guess I'll ask my son. So, I don't know. Anyhow, I don't do Disney. Not because of anything, not because of any religious thing or anything like that. I just don't do Disney because my children, my child is an adult. Okay, guys, I like this. I love headbands. I just don't have hair. And let's see. Let me cover my bald spot real good. I have a big old bald spot. So did I get my bald spot covered? Pretty much. Anyway, I don't have hair, but I love that. If I had hair, I'd be rocking it. Rocking and rolling it. But I have no hair. I support DVNF. It's a, a department, Disabled Veterans National Foundation. So, that's cool. It'll go up there with the key rings. Oh, that's pretty. I bet y'all want to see again, don't you? Let's see if I can get it untangled. Heck far. Another ugly something there. That one's, oh, look. Isn't he pretty? See the dove? Oh, buddy. I like buddies. So, I missed it. I missed it. Church on Wednesday nights cuts into Wednesday auctions for me. When I got home from church, Des was still going on her auction, so I bought a few purses. Because we all know I need purses, right? <gasps> hiss boo, hiss boo, hiss boo. Oh dear, oh dear, I'm going to have to touch it. Oh. Oh. 
what is wrong with people and why do they do this to me? They know I don't like to touch feathers. Oh, feathers make me hyperventilate just about. So, like, and it's not because I'm a girly girly because I can hang and do boy uh, manly type stuff with the best of them. I can cut wood. I can do whatever I need. But feathers gross me out. I have a friend who died of of uh, of uh, a stenosis that was caused by stepping on bird feathers and bird poop in his bare feet. Well, he wasn't a friend. He was a family member. So, anyway. Yeah, that's gross. You have a friend with stenosis. So, yeah. Uh, birds are nasty. They're gross. And while I know those are probably not, that, that feather probably has not ever seen a real bird. It still grosses me out. Now, those are pretty little chips. That is really pretty. That's like real beachy. Bougie or, or Casey needed this on the beach. Yes, birds carry diseases. So, but one of the funnest springs we ever had when my boys were little, we got baby chickens and uh, we would... Uh, hang over the brooder and watch chick tv we had so much fun we watched them john had his own special little chicken that followed him around would sit on his shoulder it was one of those easter egg aricana chickens and uh anyway but it died because it froze to death because the other chickens were mean to it okay guys this is beautiful beautiful okay wait it's got a stinking bend in it. Okay, people, you can't be bending the merchandise. Look, it's pretty. It's got a bend. I'm going to have to work on that. It is also Vendome. Very nice. Vintage? Most definitely vintage. So, very cool. Ooh, that looks like a belt buckle. Uh, for a very very fine belt, it has all this stuff back here, but it's um, it's um, enamel. Yeah, that's the word I'm looking for, enamel. <laughs> uh, a no name watch. Some. Oh, haha! <laughs> that's so funny. Some earrings that can be made into bracelets that are plenty big enough for bracelets. So, oh my goodness gracious. Some broken this that is just not right. Don't put this broken junk in my bag. So, some this. And I hate this. This is just like of the devil, y'all. This this piano wire stuff. Piano wire des deserves to stay in pianos. These are, oh, who remembers these? Pop it. You pop that in that. Who remembers those? They're little kids. That'll be saved for my Jossie. So, my sweet Jocelyn. This one says Carrie or Corey one. Little multi thing bracelet. Ooh. Ooh. What is it? It's a pendant. But what does it go on? So. Okay. There's. What does it go on? Long nails. It says if someone else came up, she would swoop them. What? What are they talking about? Mockingbirds. Yuck. Yeah. 
I love hummingbirds, but hummingbirds are very, very aggressive. They're very aggressive. They do not like to share their food. They're very aggressive. This is very weird. So we have these little pearls here. And they feel yucky. They feel dirty, dirty. But they have a really weird fastener on them. Really weird. So you got this little barrel, barrel thing that has this little safety thing that, okay, it comes apart. It's magnetic in there. But but then your beads are attached. That's all weird. It's, it's, it's hokeyed up, bad hokeyed up. <gasps> I found a treasure. plastic ring with tape somebody was somebody's girlfriend and they gave them a tape <gasps> i did find a treasure that time look it's turtles it's turtles turtle 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 turtles yes it's turtles the beauty must ooh ooh pretty but I know, had know not of what it is. Uh, it's a broken bracelet is what it is. Look at those beads. Aren't they gorgeous? Hmm. I know people that will fight over those beads. I should not let people fight over beads. Why? Tell me why. Can you tell me why? Why? Why do we do this? Pony beads on leather. On dirty leather. Why? Tell me why. Tell me why. Why, why, why. It's nasty. That's wooden beads. I think we should outlaw the use of leather. And cord. And ribbon and jewelry y'all it get you wear it around your neck your neck gets sweaty it gets nasty it's nasty here's some more wooden charms uh i mean wine charms wooden charms i'm a nut so that, i'll be okay there's another wine charm this one here i'm not sure about what it is and what the symbol is I guess it's just a star. I don't know. I don't know. So it's a. It almost looks like the Russian flag symbol. But it's this. A star like that. A five point star. And then that. And. Uh. The back of that almost feels like silver. Let's see if it's magnetic. Hey, Adam. No, it's not. It's not silver. It's magnetic. So I know nothing about this. So it's interesting, but I know nothing about it. So that one there is a little aquamarine looking birthstone necklace. Hummingbirds are, uh, they're gorgeous, and I love to put up feeders, but last year I put up a feeder, and I had something that happened that had never happened to me before in all the years that I've put up feeders, and I had multiple feeders at my last house. Uh, my feeders filled up with ants. So what's up with that? I don't know. It was gross. The ants came marching down the thing. So that's really cute. It has that. It's a little heart. has a little aquamarine stone in it. Looks like a little birthstone necklace. has a little bit there. So I'll say it has a little bit of a kink there. So anyway. This is cool. 
there's a whole bunch of these wine charms, guys. A whole bunch of them. I think it makes like six or eight I've picked up. So I'm guessing this is a purse fob, is what it looks like to me. But it has a little purse on it. It has a heart. Has a uh, some kind of pirate coin. No, Republic. Uh, of France, a uh, little heart, yeah, I'm thinking purse charm, I don't know what that is, but it's sticking my belly, now this is the reason I bought this, and it's probably what was sticking me, I was hoping that, let's see if it says anything on its little thingamabob, mm, no, does not, Guys, if, you, if you're friends with me on Facebook, watch later. I'm going to be A.B. on a row. I'm going to be posting some pictures that I took in town today because town is for the one of the tornadoes hit. And uh, there was some major trees down, major huge trees. You know what? I didn't show you all that. It's a little rhinestone tennis looking bracelet. No name. Uh, infinity rhinestone bracelet. A gorgeous ring that is sizable. It will go on with the, uh, I never showed y'all how, the blue ring. I had the blue ring on. <laughs> you probably saw it. The blue ring. Oh, this is cute. Okay. Don't be a tangle. Don't be a tangle. Don't be a tangle. Be pretty and don't be tangled. Listen now. Listen. Oh, you evil, evil designer. Whoever you are, you're evil. Put a nasty ribbon on that. Oh. No, I do not have new internet service. I have a... Uh, I'm just on my regular internet today. So most of the time I'm on an extender and uh, my extender is trying to die. So that's why my internet service has been wonky wonky. So, uh, but yeah, my extender is, oh, uh, guess who this is? I should have known as soon as I saw the silly ribbon. This is Betsy Johnson. Why, why, Betsy, why? It's got the little heart key with the Betsy Johnson on it. It's got this little thingamabob here that's got the ribbon and the big blingy, blingy, and blingy, blingy there, and flowers, and the Betsy Johnson key. Anyway, so, and I'm always, y'all know me, I'm always paranoid about Betsy Johnson. SWSC, what does that say? Academic Mike All Conference. That's a cute pendant. And this one is a cute little, huh? That's very interesting. Let's see. It's non magnetic. Okay, the spring is magnetic. Okay, nope, it's magnetic. It's a uh, little tennis rhinestone looking bracelet. Uh, a friend makes life sweeter. Oh, isn't that sweet? So, we have a really, really um, not great internet service here because I live in a really small town. But, uh, it's, I mean, I've had worse. So, this one is missing a, a fish hook, but I have fish hooks. They're little angels. They're cute. So, and a little dolphin with a little red rhinestone. And that's all that's in there. So, let's see. We've been here 50 minutes. And I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to go through this uh, religious lot really quick because uh, I want to... Uh, Make sure that I can get it put up and put away. So now not everything is religious in it. Oh, I want to take that off. That off. 
and I'm going to take all of these little fake rings. I'm going to leave this little one on here because I'm going to test it for silver or later. I will tell y'all later if it is silver. So, but, um, so I've got this God Bless America wooden brooch pin thing. I've got this, um, it's a star pendant and it's plastic. And it has the crash on it, the nativity scene. And all of this came from Des. So keep family close to your heart, which that's not necessarily religious, but, and it is signed SM, and I don't know who SM is. I haven't got to research it. So it's a necklace, looks like that, has this heart with the rhinestone in it that sets over I mean pearl a uh, teardrop and then a heart signature that says SM so anyway you love lime school's out for the summer school's out here to got a little angel hat pin stick pin whatever you want to call it got a little angel tack pin a little angel brooch made out of beads beautiful cross this is a beautiful cross guys uh like so very very pretty very pretty mm, there okay. real pretty nothing no uh, maybe that's something wrote on it what i do with that I'm hot. I don't have air going in here. Nope, that's not nothing. Okay. Uh, uh, I don't know why this was in a religious lot, but anyway, it looks like Christmas, a Christmas floral arrangement. It's a brooch. It lays like that. So anyway, this one has a cross and a a saint on it. I don't know what saint. Uh, a cross pin back. A he touched me in a cross pin back. Oh, it's hot here. We've got Aragon. Special nurse pin back. That's really cool. I think I may send it to Cindy Jewelry Nurse. Um, lay it right here so I know it's a Christmas tree that says happy birthday Jesus on it. It's cute. Enameled. Uh, a porcelain pinback angel. A wooden angel. A Christmas tree earring. And I'm hoping the other one is there. And let me do that. Uh, a come let us adore him Santa kneeling at the baby in the manger a really pretty oh I'm dropping all that in there that's okay I'm going to separate it out a really really pretty cross it's enameled uh, not enameled it's like a it's kind of like that Oh, what is it like that? Uh, kind of like that cross that I bought from Bougie the other day where it's, there's a picture laying down on metal and then they put a rosin over it, a clear rosin over it. I don't know what that style is called. Yay, 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 yay. Did I, what did I do with that? There's the other Christmas tree earring. I love it. Ooh, those are pretty. Those will go over in the Christmas trees. There's another Christmas tree. Put all my Christmas stuff separate. Okay, this is real pretty. This little angel brooch and pendant. And it's just metal. This is a angel pendant. And I don't know if you're going to be able to see this. But this angel is holding a little heart that is done what in almost what looks like artificial gold stone. Real glittery, real, real glittery. Uh, some kind of religious symbol with a cross and a heart. 
this is beautiful this will go into my collection of cameos <laughs> i hadn't even seen this okay this is can you see it it's done cameo style and it, it's the little kids walking over the bridge with the angel over watching them can y'all see that that is gorgeous 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 no signature of any kind um now this this that i'm showing here this religious lot came from des and then this is the exact same thing in blue and it too will go in with my cameos i don't know if y'all realize this but this these kind of pins like this are also considered cameo because they are done in cameo style these are not real yeah they're just rosin they're not uh anyway i'm not following the chat so if y'all have issues y'all work it out okay so or if we're just talking things out that's fine too this is um i don't know who that is it's a saint in a three-leaf clover anybody know who that saint is these are baby feet and I actually have a package of pin backs. Uh, this one here is. Uh, I don't know. It's a Saint pendant. Uh, this one here says. Has a cross into an M. And it has. Uh, something I pray. Uh mary conceived something i don't know anyway uh a catholic um pendant i don't know what this symbol is i do not know what that symbol is if you know what that symbol is please tell me tell me it looks like a whole bunch of i don't know hugs around a cross i don't know Uh, Jesus on the cross inside the pendant. Angel pen. Cute little angel pen. Focusing good. That little angel has almost an oriental look to her, don't she? She almost look like orient, oriental. So, was it Moses? St. Patrick? Okay, thank you. Uh, St. Patrick on the uh, on the clover. Is that who you're talking about? This is a sweet little angel, but I'm not real sure what this little angel is because she has no way to fasten on to anything. Like, no way. There's no rings, no jump rings, no nothing. She has no way to fasten on to something. So... The Ithacus fish, a angel coin, another angel coin. Anybody know why there's angel coins? Angel coins. Anybody know what what the angel coins are about? They're just coins with angels on them. They're cool. You carry that little angel in your pocket that says faith. Do you carry the angel coins in the pocket too? Is that a certain religion that does that? So these that have the M on the back of them, they have uh, Mother Mary Jesus, Mary Mother of Jesus on the front. They have pictures of Mary Mother of Jesus. And they are. And then there's a chain for all of it this is a little angel um uh, praying hands uh into a cross i don't know hey susan in a heart 
a cross. This one's a pretty cross. The, oh, that's cool. That's uh, Mother Mary, the outline of her. That's a cool little pen. It's a little brooch. Uh, praying hands, cross, rose. This always make me makes me think of Mother's Day because when I was a kid, they used to give out pins like that at Mother's Day. So this is really nice. A, a pin back of Jesus. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Uh cross in a heart. Uh It looks like Mother the Mary of Je Mary, Mother Jesus holding baby Jesus, holding Jesus as a toddler is what it looks like. Anyway, the Ithacus Jesus fish. Um, Mother Mary, a chain, an angel, a dove, a dove praying hands. Uh, an angel, Jesus on the cross, a sweet little angel, another angel, some of these are the same thing, this here is an angel that is love, and I'm guessing it's something you carry in your pocket too, because it has nothing to fasten it, so I'll lay it over here with these other things that you carry in your pocket this one here is really neat it's enamel let's see if i can make it show okay there we go you see that it's enamel it's a red heart with the crown of thorns on it and a cross above it that's kind of cool all on a antique gold and it's a little bitty pen little bitty 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 i mean it's not even as big as my fingernail teeny tiny Yeah, they thought the barges broke loose, but they did not break loose. So, but they watched it all night. That wasn't too far from where it was on our news all night. So, a little angel pen. This is love, let love ring out. And I'm guessing this is, it kind of looks like Christmassy. And it's a brooch pen. Uh, this is... Is that a Holy Communion pen, guys? Isn't that a Holy Communion pen? The grapes in the cup. I think that's a Holy Communion pen. So. Uh, this is an angel. Hey, boo. Another angel. Oh, this angel has a green birthstone on him. Uh, who do we know that was born in August? This one says. Oh, Mary conceived without sin. Pray for us who have recourse to the i don't know what that means i may live across from the catholic church but i don't know much about catholicism so but it's really pretty really really pretty i'm not sure what the i guess the cross with m on it means mary here's another one of those pins that i think is holy communion so hey tara here is another Catholic Saint pen. This one here. There's just something they call this cross. Does anybody know? I mean, it's not just a cross cross, but they I think it has a name. Does anybody know what that name is that for that kind of cross?
really pretty. These are some things that I got from Des. A pair of really nice cross earrings. A um, little cross tie tack, tie pin back. Um, the heart and the cross. There were multiples of this. Angels. Praying hands. This is a pin with a dingle dangle and a, a saint. No, it's not a saint. It's the... Mm, and I don't mean to be disrespectful towards any denomination. I call this the Methodist symbol. I don't know if it is or not. It's the cross with the flame going up the side. Um, can anybody see that? Is that going to focus in? Okay, here we go. There. I call that the Methodist symbol. That's usually the symbol you see on Methodist signs here. So, there, that. So, United Methodist. Okay. Uh, this is pretty. Oh, I want to put this. Where did I put that pin that says special nurse? Did I, is that right there? There, yeah, special nurse. So, look at this. This is an angel. An angel tack pin with a nurse hat on. Let's see. Come on. Focus, focus. There you go. It's an angel with a little nurse's hat on. So, isn't that an... Yeah, that's an angel with a nurse's hat. Cute, cute, cute. Okay. This is just a little angel pin. The little one that I showed earlier is a Lutheran symbol. I have to look up Lutheran symbols so I know. So, anyway, but I have a... So, there's a, that little angel. She says something on the back of her. Let's see what she says. A. A. P. So, A. A. P. Uh... Another one of those coins, only this one is not, don't have angels on it. It has all the, all things whatsoever ye would, you should do unto, okay, it's the, um, the golden rule. It's the golden rule. So, and then this one here is a little saint. Probably Mary, the mother of Jesus. Most of them have been Mary, the mother of Jesus. Yep, it's Mary. So, that's the end of the religious lot. So, so while I have y'all here right quick, let's just see if this little booger here is silver. Ooh. It looks like it's going to be silver, girls. It does, it does, it does. And where did my froggies go? <gasps> where did my turtle go? There's that turtle. There's that turtle. Now, how am I going to test that? It's supposed to be sterling. How am I going to test it? Well, let's scratch this little tail. There. Now, let's test this turtle. See, I got a new turtle. And he's marked 9252. And we'll test this turtle over here and we'll go ahead and scratch his chain too i haven't even put a magnet on his chain yet uh, i'm thinking his chain's not going to be silver but that's okay i'll probably have a silver chain okay green turtle ring chain turtle So, we've got, and let me get some napkins to hold this right under the edge here. There we go. 
Okay. We've got green turtle ring chain, not silver turtle silver. So was a silver ring. Yay! So anyway, I'm happy. I got two new turtles today, and they're both silver. Only the chain is not silver, but that's okay. That's okay. Susan Gill, are you still here, honey bunch? Susan Gill, look at here. What I got, what I got, what I got. Aren't those pretty, pretty beads? Look at that. And a little bracelet, and it's, I mean, when I say little, the keyword here is little. Has a box clasp, and the box clasp is broke. Very, very sad. Very sad. Anyway, but yeah, that is silver. So, and it is tiny. We talked about this the other day, boo. So, okay, guys. Tonight, are you doing are you doing auction tonight on Glam Squad, boo? This is a size four ring. This ring is a stinking size four. It's teeny, teeny, tiny, and it's silver, and it's got these little rhinestones. Let's see. And what looks like a Celtic twist, Celtic braid. Let's see if I can get it to focus here. Mm, go the other way, Cindy. There you go. Cherry can wear it. <laughs> Cherry's got teeny tiny fingers. There we go. Anyway, it ain't going over my fat knuckles. And I'm sweating, sweating like a politician on election day. So, but I've got a big now. I just, y'all, I must be a glutton for punishment because I just got all my jewelry sorted. Just got it all sorted, and now I've brought in all this other stuff. So, anyway, I've got a bunch of, I don't want to lose those because that's a bunch of jump rings. I need jump rings. I need jump rings. I was stealing jump rings from things last night, so don't tell nobody. Okay, did Bougie answer me? Yeah, my pinky is a size 6. So, did Bougie answer me? Is she having a sale tonight? Bougie, I need to know because my my adoring crowd wants to know, is Bougie having an auction tonight? There we go. Mmm. Okay, so this is cute. It's a little, uh, mm, just a little pendant stacker thing. And it's got my birthstone colors in it, so it's cute. Oh, looky there, looky there. It's a wee little owl, a wee little owl. Now, these little things like this would be cool on a charm bracelet. Little things. And that would be what all this mess is. Supposed to be from a charm bracelet. Oh, cool. That sounds pretty, Barbie. So. No auction tonight. You moved it to tomorrow night. You've been working on the moon pool. Okay. Then we will be there with bells on. And uh, so if you're interested in any of those. Uh, wow, Barbie, you're paying up on stuff. If you're interested on any in any of the religious things that I showed today, uh, please contact me and let me know because I'll be happy to make you a deal. And don't forget a week from tonight. Did, is this the one that uh, Susan said is the Episcopal symbol? Is that the one that Susan was talking about is the Episcopal symbol? So, I don't remember. Anyway, uh, if you are interested in any of that, just let me know. And I will work with you as much as possible. And don't forget that next, a week from tonight, I'm going to be doing a dollar and two dollars sale 
a dollar and two dollar sale and i'm going to have tubs and tubs of stuff so and we're going to sell a lot of things but we're going to move it fast we're not going to linger because i will have multiples of a lot of it so that more than one person can win it so feels kind of monet feels kind of not monet so i love when you say that it's not monet <laughs> Those are for Cindy Jewelry Nurse. Let's see. Is Dragonfly Girl here? I've got... If Dragonfly Girl is here. So, anyway. So, my cute little turtle bracelet is not... It doesn't... It needs some repair. It don't want to work right. Doggone it. And it's cute. So... Those are pretty. So, anyway. I'm hot. My little turtle. He's so cute. He may just get to live up there like that. Don't wear them, so just love them. So, I don't wear them. So, you'd love to see the bracelet. Not sure what bracelet you're talking about. Okay, so. Oh, the crown of thorns. Okay. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So, anyway. So, thanks guys for joining me. I'm cute. I'm hot. Look at my face. I'm hot. So, I'm not cute. I'm hot. <laughs> so, I'm going to put this in my. This is my. Right down here is my junk box that has all of my things in it for junk so look i'm wearing feathers today they're not real they're metal feathers i like metal feathers but i don't like real feathers that just ain't right just ain't right did y'all see my hands did y'all see my hands aren't they cool see i think that'll be real pretty with the jewelry draped across it and take a picture so we'll drape some See, that would be a cute little picture of a little owl. So, now every time you see feather jewelry, you'll think of me. Listen, I do not do feathers. I got, yeah, I don't do feathers. So, I do love the hands. So, anyway, and more than likely, uh, this little bag will be going up for sale. So, he's cute. Isn't he cute? So, anyway, oh, if anybody's interested, I have a bag of about a hundred pairs of earrings. There's just about, um, the last count I was at was, I was like between 70 and 80 and I lost count and I didn't want to pour them out. So I'm guessing, I'm going to say there's about 75 pairs of earrings in here. Most of them are dingly danglies. Uh, if you're interested and want them, want to buy these for, say, $10, contact me. Nope, all pierced. I think there may be one pair of clip-on earrings in here. One pair of clip-on earrings. The rest of them are pierced. So if you're interested and want to buy them for $10, shoot me an email. We can make a deal. So... This is, oh, Mary, okay, Mary Pelletier already said she wants them. Gotcha, Mary. I will, uh, I will shoot you an invoice on them, and, uh, and, uh, the shipping shouldn't be bad on them, so they weigh less, they weigh less than a pound, so, so, uh, okay, I, I got you, I got you, so, so remember, next week, next Thursday night, y'all remember what's happening? We're going to do a dollar and two dollar sale on jewelry and if you want me to show you some of the kind of things that will be in it i can do that right quick like uh stuff like this will be in it this is magnetic um one of those magnetic necklaces stuff like that hoop earrings 
uh, just stuff like this stuff that you can easily sell even buying it at a dollar you can easily sell for a couple of dollars if you have a booth or a if you do a, a, a sale then like see i have let's see there's three bracelets in here i do bracelets together bracelet likes that so uh um next thursday night one dollar and two dollars look at this look at those beautiful actually those won't be in it because those uh somebody wants those i know they do i know they do these are glass beads and they're uh they're artisan beads and uh i have a friend that wants those and i think her name is susan yeah i'm pretty sure her name is susan and i think she wants those but look at those earrings are those not cool they'll be in the dollar sale so we're going to be doing dollar sale i'll have cards that i'll have multiple pairs of earrings on them for a dollar then i have all those little dollar earrings that i showed y'all in the hall earlier so there will be a lot of things there will be literally hundreds of items we will move through them fast and sell them a whole week away yeah misha a whole week away so anyhow a whole week away so uh you know what bougie's not doing her sale tonight i could do one tonight couldn't i oh wait bouge okay bougie's doing hers tomorrow night what time bougie Because uh, I don't know if you saw that Mary Sebastian signed up at 2 o'clock tomorrow. So, anyway, I just haven't changed it. So, Mary Sebastian's doing one at 2. So, anyway. But, uh, you're busy next week? Okay, guys. So, how about it is, what time is it? It is 5 o'clock. It's five o'clock. Do it tonight. Okay. Okay. I'm going to do it tonight. Tomorrow is payday. <laughs> go now. Go now over there. Do I want to go now here? How about if we if i stop here and come back okay and we'll come back and do one okay i like youtube too so i'm going to stop here and i'm going to come back with a sale okay we're going to do a pop-up sale okay. i'm going to go here and we'll come right back okay but i've got to get some water first Okay, I'll be right back. Uh, it's 4.51. I'll be back at 5 o'clock. That's okay, Susan. You know that. You know that you have good credit with me. So, uh, I'm, I'll am i be back at 5 o'clock in 7 minutes, okay? I'm going to go 6 Eastern. Yes, I'll be back, okay? So, Susan, you know you have good credit with me. So, don't worry about that. So, okay? Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, bye.